The Lions 6-11 on the season, but all but one of those wins came all the way back in March and April. The winner here goes on to play Evanston in the second round. We're scoreless well into the first quarter. This is a defensive battle through and through. Lions Township on the board first. The team beats Central goalie Bill Young on the near side for a 1-0 lead. That score is still holding up come the second quarter. A few minutes in, it's the Red Hawks looking to change that. Here's Scott LePoe curling around the crease. Not a lot of mustard on this shot, but it's placed in the right spot. All knotted up at one. The overcast skies are creeping in, and so is the central offense. Nick Roy doing a good job of facilitating. He found LePoe on that first goal. This one is for Colin J. McDonald, 2-1 Hawks. One more quick strike comes inside the final minute of the first half. Instead of Roy passing, this time he's shooting 3-1 at the break. This is a relatively low-scoring affair, so a two-goal lead is bigger than it seems. No worries for the Lions, though. They cut their deficit in half earlier in the third quarter. This goal brings LT even with Central. It's a whole new ball game at 3-3. Three three. Two minutes left in the third. It's Central taking back that precious lead. Adam Borghetti strikes with some heavy momentum behind him. The running shot gets to the net unimpeded. 4-1 NC. In the fourth, LT gets its chances, but for the most part, Central does a good job of closing the door. Along with another goal, the Red Hawks take care of business. They're five to three winners. First round of playoffs, we were coming out kind of slow the first half. Uh, we really had to come out second half. You can see on the sidelines, everything was so much, so much more intensified. Uh, you know, we come out hitting, and uh, yeah, I think we played a much better second half and came back.